Hi guys, welcome to another David Zimalara. Today is going to be Zimalara landscaping equipment that I've been purchasing today. Two of them is for my kids. Doesn't this guy take you back? Do you remember some of you guys having one of these in your childhood? Well, I thought I'll, make, I'll give my kids uh, the same type of experience. It's getting this one for little Jason, which is a 14 inch uh, cutting and we got a 16 inch uh, over here on this side. Dad is going to have the big $400 Honda one. This is going to be a video right after. I would like to make a review on it. Let's see what's what's this about. It's a Honda. You can't go wrong with the Honda, I guess. So let's see what it takes uh, to put one of these things together. Uh, I've been getting some requests uh, to make more videos on some of my landscaping uh, equipment. I just bought a couple of these things here for my kids and a mower for myself. It's a Honda. That's going to be a review in a separate video. But we got a 16 here and a 14 Elite Push Mowers. That's basically your the engine. Uh, perfect for kids. We just actually unboxed that one. That's the one you guys seen in the beginning of the video. I was pushing around and mowing some grass. And we're going to open this one up. I want to show you guys how to put this thing together the easy way. They're easy to put together if you basically know what you're doing so let's pull this stuff out here so this one we want to set aside so we got a couple more bars here we got this here all right so these are all the parts so you can get rid of that there these are your handles, pull them out, so basically go ahead and uh, put your rubber pieces on there, so we got this handle on here, we're going to go ahead and put this one, so we got this one on here as well, now we want to go ahead and place it on the table like this, we're going to pull our little tools out here, there's a couple little C-clamps, move them on the side and then we got different sizes things here um, one of them is a shorter one that one's gonna go here these two are gonna go here open this one up that one up as well that one's gonna go like this <clears throat> this one's gonna go like that put them together Slide it in there. Put a little washer on there. Get it nice and finger tight. Okay, I'm gonna loosen it up just a little bit. We're gonna go ahead and uh, install this little guy here. little washer guys I always wanted one of these when I was a kid I've seen them in movies especially like uh, older 60s movies and uh, I don't think they even sold these things in the store so I'm glad they made a comeback so we're almost done here guys this is just a couple little parts left and we could go ahead and assemble this is actually the hardest piece um, out of the whole job and as you can see it's Pretty easy to do. All right, so that's done. So now, this little thing here, this is where you put the handle in those little places. So Okay, the handle's on there, and then you use a little C-clamps, put them inside of these holes here, and you could use a little rock to actually put these things uh, in there. That's what I do to snap them in. It's a toolless procedure, but I cannot snap it in using my skin. 
There you go. It is done. As soon as you start on the floor, it's not Well guys, I put it together. It was not hard to put it together. But basically you roll it and you got the rotating blades right there. So let me give you guys a closer look where everything goes. So here's this machine up close. This is a 16 Elite one. It's got a two year warranty. For some reason the other one, it's not Elite and it's got one year warranty. Uh, with a 14 but obviously you put the handles lay them out on the table and then you put these uh things right here lay them out as well and you're gonna attach it right there using these little c-clamps basically it's a very simple it's pretty much a toolless type of process that's all it is so now i'm gonna give it to one of my kids and let him go at it 